You don't need yet another startup to tell you that congestion and pollution are terrible in cities all over the world, not just in the US. But maybe you could let yourself be convinced by this particular startup that it could do something about it. That startup is Trinova, founded by German-born but California-based mechanical engineer and vehicle designer Marcus Scholten, who is working to bring the Trinova EV to market. While it's an electric vehicle, the Trinova would best be described as a fully enclosed, tilting tricycle that would most likely classify as a motorcycle in most territories. Like any other EV, the Trinova would help with pollution, as it would offer a more sustainable form of urban mobility, one that wouldn't be reliant on fossil fuels. Like any other trike, it would help with congestion too, since it would take up less space in the city landscape, both on the road and in parking structures. But the Trinova is dreaming even bigger than that. It's imagined as a real solution to real roads, real struggles, offering car-like convenience in a motorcycle-like form factor, thus bring together only the advantages of each. As the teaser for the Trinova EV says, the world is a not a car commercial, where all you see is the open road, no traffic, and clear, crisp air. The world is getting stuck in traffic for hours on end, stressed out and missing out on time you could spend in more enjoyable ways. The world of car commercials doesn't exist, so implicitly, buying a car won't solve anything. It will only make things worse. Indeed, the Trinova declares war on passenger cars and even targets other electric vehicles like the Tesla Model 3 and the Verge TS Ultra motorcycle, with which it compares itself favorably. The Trinova is more efficient, cheaper, and more convenient because you can operate it on a motorcycle license, yet it offers comparable advantages in terms of range, safety, and comfort. Trinova doesn't exist yet, but it could, and soon, if you're willing to bet on it. Scholten says that the company has joined a crowdfunding-type investment platform in the hope of securing funds to launch limited production, or what would become the founder's edition for the Trinova. In addition, they're taking reservations on the official page at $250 a pop, fully refundable. Trinova is a two-seater little EV with a patented tilting mechanism that would ensure stability on the road and excellent handling on corners. Offering tandem seating and a fully enclosed cockpit, it offers protection against the elements and would be suitable for the daily commute, even including a stop to drop the kid to school or kindergarten. The reason why there's not as much as a render of the interior is that the design is not yet final. A note on the official page invites designers to collaborate, sending in their design suggestions in exchange for $1 in royalty for every unit sold, if their proposal gets picked up. One possibility Scholten is considering is having the rear seat fold down to create more cargo space in the back. Unlike many other trikes, renders or real, the Trinova would be highway capable. It would come with an AI-powered gap detection system, or what the website calls a co-pilot, guardian, and guide for every journey, using cameras and AI to analyze the road ahead and detect gaps in traffic, among other things. And that's the real highlight of this proposed EV, the ability to do lane splitting where it's legal. Since congestion will most likely not improve in the coming years, Trinova proposes using a vehicle that is narrow enough to slip through it, while offering more protection than an open motorcycle. The emphasis on safety is repetitive, though there's no other mention of whether it would extend beyond the integration of an AI system. From photos posted to social media, the only detail glimpsed is that the most recent prototype has a tubular metal frame. Scholten says for that he's built three functional prototypes so far, two with electric drivetrains from Zero Motorcycles and one with a combustion engine from Aprilia. The plan is to put dual motors in the rear hubs of the Trinova, with a top speed in excess of 120 miles per hour, and a 0 to 60 miles per hour of 3.5 seconds. A 10 or 12 kWh battery would guarantee a range of up to 140 miles, with level 2 and Reagan charging. With a body width of just 850 mm, the Trinova would take up a third of the space of a single parking spot and could even park in areas where cars wouldn't be allowed. Estimated curb weight is of 750 pounds. Assuming the Trinova makes it into production, prices will start at $18,000 and probably go as high as $23,000 with options, though what these might be is unclear. Then again, seeing how there isn't even a completed design for this EV, talking about add-ons feels a bit premature. So, what do you think about this EV? If it comes out, are you going to buy one? Let me know your opinions in comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe.